Congressman and ambassador and civil rights icon Andrew Young will celebrate his 90th birthday tomorrow. And what's so cool is this is a celebration that actually kicked off a couple days ago. There's a young picture of Andrew Young, who, of course, also served as our mayor in the 80s. But here you're looking at City Councilman Byron Amos, who was at the Peace Walk yesterday, which is part of Andrew Young's celebration, and ended with an unveiling of this cool statue. Wow. How awesome is that? Happy birthday. I have to say, I am, I, it's one of, it is probably the, my favorite thing about living in this city is getting to be a part of such culture and the icons that walk amongst us. It's so cool. So The rich yeah, history. That. He's yeah. one of the last living, of course, that was part of MLK's inner circle. And he talked about how Dr. Martin Luther King told him, we might not make it to 50, mm -hmm. but if you do, make it to 100 because there's so much work to be done. Yes, so much work to be done. And thank yeah. you, sir, and happy birthday. Amen. Love that. And moving on to another event this weekend, of course, the St. Patrick's Day Parade here in Midtown, the longest celebration, oh. will be back on the streets. It's the 138th annual. So, of course, you'll see the marching bands, all the green, um, and so much more. I mean, look at these. What are, the, what are those? Star Wars? What are they called? <laughs> yeah. Stormtroopers. Stormtroopers. <laughs> uh, oh, I went a few years ago when gents. I first got here. I was just going to say, St. Patrick's Day, I know it's not, <laughs> yes. but it's like a young person's holiday. Oh, because I feel it's like just boozy and it's wild? It's so wild, yes. I lived in Chicago yeah. for a few St. Patrick's days, and they dye the river green there. It's very cool. Yes, yes. of course. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So right grab now. a green pint this weekend, yes. head down to Midtown, and see all the sights. Love, Love that. It. Llamas oh. are always there. Llamas? <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Why wouldn't they be? Why not? Yeah, it's people so in your neighborhood. You and Christine featured Griffin oh, Hatcher. Yes. He's actually an autistic drummer. He's a senior in high school in the area, but he's going to be at Georgia Tech in the fall. And what's so cool, if we can show Tim Tebow's comment on his Instagram, mm -hmm. because his mission really is uh, to, to talk about autism in school. And Tim Tebow said, hey, man, keep on getting it. Keep on doing it. Bring a light to the Lord. That is so awesome, says Tim that. Tebow. I love that we're highlighting people right here in our community, and especially such amazing young man, men as him. Thanks, Kara. Thank you. I'm going to be at your weekend. house tonight for okay, Mark. Wait. Oh, oh can't wait, wait. You've got to get on a flight. Okay, no, no. You're always welcome. All right. Thank you so much. Thank you for letting me be with you all week. We'll see you next week.